here with head coach Peter Ewald, Franklin Pierce Sprint football team. Franklin Pierce coming off their first one of the season, first one in program history last Friday at Penn, or Princeton, that is. And uh, they got the week off this week before they go to Mansfield next week. First off, coach. How exciting is it to get uh, that first it's, win? It's uh, it's a great feeling, and you know it's especially a great feeling for our players, you know, because they're the ones that are putting in the hard work, and they're the ones that are coming to practice every day, and, and uh, with the numbers that we have, the small numbers that we have, uh, it's just fantastic to see them have some success. Uh, bye week coming at a good time, or would you rather play again and keep this momentum rolling? What, what works best for you? That, it, that's it, it's a great question, and I think everyone wants to play. Yeah. You know, we're just we're dying to play. But I think with the amount of players that we have, again, it's a great opportunity for us to get some rest and uh, to, to heal up and because we get banged up. And it's uh, it's really a, it's, it's a good opportunity for us. But I think everyone really wants to play offensively. You guys have a lot of young kids this year, so you would think that the offense would maybe lag a little bit. But if you looked at the league standings, if you guys were able to be eligible, you guys would be in the top half of the league in total offense this year. Just talk about offensively, how you guys are coming together so far this season. Yeah, I think our execution is getting better every week. Uh, and and we're, we're, we're coming together more every week. And that that's a recipe for success. Defensively, uh, two of the three games you've held the opponent under 300 yards total offense. That's uh, you, you expect those things out of more veteran defenses that have seen a lot more, but uh, again, a lot of young guys, and, and they're they're getting the, they're making the plays when they need to. I think we're trying to keep it as simple as possible defensively, and the bottom line is we're trying to get to the ball, and and when we get to the ball, we're all meeting at the ball, and I think our pursuit and, and all those good things, those fundamental basic fundamentals, are helping us uh, be a good defense. Uh, you were a DB as a player. Uh, Derek Reddy comes in in his first game has basically just a week of practice. He makes a uh, team high 10 tackles. Just talk about his performance in, uh, in the game on Friday. What can you say about uh, Derek? He's, he's done a great, he did a great job. He came in, he had the right attitude. He wanted to learn. He wanted to contribute right away. He wanted to work at it as well and, and ask questions and, and really learn very quickly. And, and he's, he's naturally a good athlete and he did a great job for us. Michael Holdridge gets a touchdown pass. He uh, had uh, five receptions in the game. Uh, another it seems you guys are putting a, producing a lot of receiving targets for a young quarterback and Tyler Matthews. Just talk about him and maybe just the receivers, how they're uh, trying to, to make it a little bit easier for the quarterback. You no, know, I think Mike has a great feel uh, in particular for just getting, having the right knack to be in the right places at the right time and has a good feel for where to sit down and, and, and when to move into the right areas to, to make himself available for Tyler to throw in the ball. So I think that is, is his, his edge. Uh, I think he does a great job with that. And he's, he's a tall target, so that also helps. But I think our receiving core is thin. However, we're, 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 um, we're enthusiastic, we work hard, and we, we, we try to get into the areas so Tyler can see us. And I think we, we do, do a good job with that. Coach Peter Ewald, Franklin Pierce Sprint Football Coach, we'll talk with you next week as you guys get ready for Mansfield. Thanks, Doug.